we are now going into the Warwick, which is a three bedroom detached home. Red Row Homes, Prize Lead Halford. Okay, so we can see a beautiful door. Yes, it is a very nice With a security. Door. Look, they've done the doormat right. They have. Security left a box. Yeah. I was trying to think of the word. <laughs> they have a doormat. We believe that is an extra. Yes, but also it doesn't infringe on no. the entrance to the living room. Oh, let's do, look at the hallway. Again, beautiful high ceilings, tall skirting boards. Very similar. Light, bright, spacious. Yeah, it's very similar to the last house we viewed, the London Low. There we go. Hang our coats because it's very hot. Yeah. Right. So again, nice white plain doors. I think you've got your heating yes. unit heating. there. Downstairs, Lou. Yeah. Okay. It's actually a carbon copy. Yeah, because it's got a nice kind of below. high window, <laughs> um, toilet. I think that's the electric. Now I actually quite like this electric box because mm. some of them are very boxy. Yeah. This is. Whereas this is water. quite. Um, yeah. So it's all your sockets. Mm. Switches, fuses. Yeah. I quite like that. Ooh. This is a better layout. It is. Well, I can't see yet. It. Oh, okay. It's a magic corner sofa. Yes, because they've. Yes, because they've done what I said in the other home, and they put the door kind of here, and they've had the the big main wall for your TV. Yeah. Okay. This looks, actually the corner sofa makes it look very spacious because there's one, two, three, four, five seats on yeah, that sofa. And there's a chair behind you as well. And there's a chair here, or you could put one almost going straight, angled at the TV. Um, nice, big, spacious, light, airy window. Hmm, mm. yeah. Nice big mirror as well, where we can do our posing, can't we? Work. Work. We can. <laughs> We can do our posing. Um, but no, it's, it's nice. Mm. It does feel spacious, doesn't it? Yeah. Um, and how many bedrooms is this one? Three. A three bedroom home. It does feel spacious. Again, I wish we had the dimensions, but we don't have the dimension. I will put them in the description box. Yeah. But we don't have them because of COVID restrictions. They won't give us the booklet. No. So I'm afraid we don't know what the sizes are. From what I can see of the optional upgrades is just the carpet in here, and that's 715. Okay, so flooring is not included. No. Okay, let's move on. I want to see what the kitchen is like. So you can see the flooring. The carpet feels nice, actually. It does, to be fair. Yeah. Um, we have a nice stairs, understairs cupboard. Mm. I think that's the alarm system, which is probably an extra in this home. And a nice deep cupboard. Yeah. Oh, the burglar alarm does not come as standard. Oh, that yeah. is 975. For the alarm. Carpet for the hallway and stairs and landing, 790. The carpet just for in here is 395 for the hallway. Yeah. And then that doormat is 350. So they, wow, for a doormat. So they yeah. really have kind of broken down the prices of the extras. Yes. Okay. Ooh. Oh, have a nice radiator which you don't often see yeah. in new built homes. With the washer dryer. Okay, washer dryer cupboard. These are extras as well. We'll go through the prices in a minute, but these are Siemens appliances. You can obviously not have them. It is up to you. Um, perfect size for a table, central table. You yeah. could even have an island installed maybe. Okay. And there is space for a sofa over here and maybe a TV above it. Um, a nice big windows. And yeah. patio, patio French doors. That is one thing all these houses have are lovely yeah. windows. So here's a typical garden, although you wouldn't get it designed like this. Turf is extra. And in this example, there would be a fence down the middle um, separating the houses. So I think you've got a garage as well, single garage with the door access over there. Again, the two-tone kitchen. Yeah, it's been the same in all of them, hasn't it? Yeah. So kind of like a... Almost a larger cupboard. Almost, but no. With no side bits, but you could probably put them on yeah, yourself. Box panda drawers. Yeah, like pan drawers. Yeah. Put your plates in, cups, whatever. Easy yeah. access. Uh, cupboard. Cupboard. Dishwasher, Dishwasher AG. AG. Box panda sink. Yeah. Corner. Mm. This is just your regular laminate worktop, yeah. but I imagine there's an upgrade. Wardrobe, wardrobe, cupboards, 
cutlery, and I'm guessing in pan drawers. Yeah. Yeah, pan drawer. So I think I've just seen, in case you're wondering what the kitchens are, I th oh no, that's a shower. That's a shower. AEG hob. Yeah, lovely. Other cupboards have we got the upstairs? Yeah, there's plenty of storage. Box as well. AEG oven and grill. Ooh, that opens the wrong way. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so cupboards there and then Fridge freezers, there's fridge. a new seat. Freezer. Mm hmm And obviously you've got a bit of a cupboard That's under there fun. for your pans. Oh, we do um, like a good rummage. We do like a good rummage. Kitchen and dining uh, extras. Flooring to the kitchen and dining, 2,830. Ooh. Dishwasher, 585. Tumble dryer, 715. Washing machine, 765. Uh, if you want an outside light, 175. And to have turf uh, and a, an outside tap, 1,015. Hmm. Okay. So you can see how if you can if you choose the extras, you can either the price will go up, yeah, or you know t to what you want. So if you wanted your own flooring uh, in the hall but not in the kitchen, you could mix and match, for example. Uh, regular kind of white switches. Okay, let's go up. Right, so nice kind of white banisters, um, kind of oaky top. Uh, there's a window to let in some nice light. Um, mm. Ooh, okay, let's start over here. Smallest bedroom, I think. Yes. Which could be a kid's room, office. Yeah, it's a, it's a decent size over a single Yeah, bed. I mean, if you were just a couple on your own, you could have this decked out as a wardrobe room yeah. or whatever you wanted. But yeah, it's a perfect sized little kid's room. Yeah. Don't grow up, it's a trap. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at the backpack. Oh. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh. Um, yeah, it's lovely. Again, they're still building on development, so this will all be developed. And I think that's the garage that comes with the house. Hmm. Okay, what do you think? <laughs> what do no, you think? It's, it's a nice size room to bear. It would be perfect as a study or as a yeah. wardrobe if you haven't got kids. No, I agree. Yeah. Uh, I think this is... Store. Oh, the boiler cupboard. Oh, yeah. Uh, Valent, quite a unusual shape. Yeah. Shallow cupboard, but you could put things, things in there. Oh, second bedroom. Yes, yes, bedroom two. So, you've got a nice wall where you could put a big bed on. Yeah. You could put wardrobes there if you wanted, or there's some here. There. Again, I think these are Hammonds. Yeah, and they're very similar on the inside yeah. of everything else that we've seen. Yeah, Hammonds. Shelf, Hammonds. Single rail. Wardrobes. Got, oh, they have got a rail. Do you know what? I've been going there, I didn't think they even had a rail, because I can't see that. No. <laughs> oh, have you not been thinking there's a rail? No. Yes, there's, there's been a rail. I think I said in the videos there's been a rail. I know, I was wondering <laughs> where you're getting that from. Because <laughs> I can see it, because <laughs> I'm low down. <laughs> So the extras in here, you can have a chest of drawers, 255, and the wardrobe to 1,400. It did say on the way up and says as well, to have a carpet in all the bedrooms, it's 1,400 pounds. Okay. They all add up, don't they? They do. All the, all the extras. But yeah, no, that is a nice kind of sized room. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and then this must be the master. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Okay, so there's no built-in wardrobe behind the door this time. But you could, but, you could. There's but there are plugs. Point. Yeah. Well, the way uh, you've got the telepoint there. I don't know. <laughs> you can have a, sw a, sw a swivel TV, perhaps. Um, okay, I like the kind of headboard. They've got the wardrobes here, so not mirrored doors this time or anything. Well, I'd have mirrored. Y yeah, mirrored makes the rooms look a and feel a little bit more spacious. So here's like an example of the inside of the cupboards. And also the view from the upstairs of the of the house from the front. So in this uh, plot, you can see kind of onto the main road. And obviously houses opposite. But I will say there's quite a good distance between the streets and the houses. Yeah. Okay, what do you think about this is a master bedroom? It's a lovely size. I'd have the mirrored wardrobe though, rather than the wood grain effect. Yeah, I think I would too. No, it's lovely. Yeah. I like it. It's big. Uh, right, the ensuite. Um, there is a, a mirrored cupboard. No, it's, it's not a cupboard, it's just a mirror, but it has got lights on it. Toilet. 
Basin cabinet 565, mirror 340, floor tiles 520. And just a, a normal shower. But I like this one because it's sliding. Yeah. Not the concertina. I like this one because it's sliding. Uh, there we go, just having a look inside so you can see. Not quite big and spacious. Yeah. Okay. Okay, going into the family bathroom, which I almost forgot to show. <laughs> uh, we have uh, a nice bathtub with a shower screen and shower above. Yeah. Must be windows for a bathroom. Yes. You've got the privacy glass as well. Uh, toilet. It's quite a nice bathroom layout, actually. It is. I prefer this to the... Because lots of houses would put the toilet by the window. Uh, because, but because it's a deep window, they put it there, which I quite like. Again, you've got the drawers to pull out. The storage, inbuilt storage. Yeah. Towel rail behind the door. Just a small towel rail. There. And there's a cupboard. Who is that? Ooh, mm. What's in there? Who is she? Oh, storage. Oh, lots of storage. It's actually very handy in a bathroom. To have it for an airing cupboard. Yeah. I wouldn't have carpet in it, though. I in think a bathroom. It, I think it just comes. <laughs> yeah, it's in a bathroom. Just... Yeah. Not for me, that one. I suppose it wouldn't get the steam, would it? No, but the cells just seem to. Yeah, and you've got your spotlights as well, and the vent system. Yeah. Hmm, quite a nice bathroom. Yeah. Okay, so we've just been in the... Warwick. The Warwick. Because in so many houses today, we forgot yeah. names of them. We're in the Warwick here at Red Row at Abbey Fields. And uh, yeah, again, this is another lovely uh, three bedroom home. Yeah. This one is detached with a garage um, and it's a beautiful home. I would definitely say that this would suit um, a young family. Yes, I definitely. Think. Um, so again, subscribe to the channel for more house tours. Bye.